Hey guys, just walking out of the gym. You know that feeling when you give it everything you got and you don't feel like you can do one more rep or take one more step? You don't? Oh, I don't either. I was hoping you did. I wanted to know what it felt like. Anyway, <laughs> hey, welcome to your morning cup of inspiration. Thanks for joining me today. As I was in the gym, I was sitting on one of the machines and I was watching this one lady who was basically doing crunches. She was sitting down but holding her feet up in the air and she had four plastic squares that were stackable and she would twist, pick up a one, put it, twist over to the other side, set it down, twist back, pick it up, set it down, and was stacking those four plastic uh, squares and then when she got done with that side she would then do it again back to the other side and I wanted so bad to walk up to her and say something but I realize usually things are funnier in my head than they really are so I didn't do it but I wanted to go up and say tap her on the shoulder and go hey uh, you know if you would just stop Think for a minute and decide which side you want all those to be stacked on. Man, you could do it one time, be done with it, and save yourself a lot of hassle. <laughs> I did not do that, however I wanted to. But it did make me think, you know, sometimes that's the way we look at life with God. You know, someone who, if they have no idea what that lady's trainer was really trying to accomplish for her to do all that, which was to build some great six-pack abs, they would think, that was craziness. Why would you keep doing that? That's got to hurt. That's got to take a lot of time. Well, you know what? That's how we look at life sometimes. We're going here. We're going there. We're not understanding. It hurts. It takes time. And we don't understand what God's trying to do. When in reality, He's trying to build our spiritual six packs. You know, He tells us all things work together for good to those that love God. So we know it works together for good. He tells us that the tribulations we go through make us stronger, but we just don't see it sometimes. And it's a little hard when you're in the middle of the battle, isn't it? Well, let me encourage you today, think like the trainer thinks. Think like God thinks. Whatever exercise you're going through, whatever plastic squares you're moving from side to side, know that God is in it, He's doing it for a purpose, and He's working on your spiritual six-pack. Hope that helps today. God bless. Thanks for joining me for that morning cup of inspiration, and we'll see you next time.